So, I get this question all the time. They say, hey, call me on the phone. Hey, Aldo, I need your help. How do I get the songs on my iPod to go back onto my computer? Now, what Apple usually does is they don't allow you to put songs from your iPod to your computer because of copyrights. They don't want people sharing music. So your hard drive crashes and you don't know what to do because as soon as you reformat your drive, Apple wants you to reformat your iTunes, your iPod, I mean. So you're basically screwed. You got to reformat your iPod. All your songs are lost. If your hard drive crashed, there's nothing you can do, right? Wrong. What you can do is Apple, if you have an Apple computer, there's something called Sanuti. And that's just iTunes spelled backwards. And what you do is you go to Sanuti. It's made by fatandgred.com. And you can Google it. It's just iTunes spelled backwards. And what it does is it allows you to download a trial version or you can buy it. It's only 18 bucks, but if you bought a ton of songs on iTunes, you don't want to lose all that money. So it's worth it to me. So you buy this program, hook up your iPod, and it takes all your songs from your iPod and puts it back onto your computer, saving you all the money and the aggravation. For you Windows users out there, we've got something called iDump iDump works on Windows 2000 XP, Windows Me, and Vista. And it basically supports all the models of the new iTouch, like this one, and the uh, iPhone also, if you have an iPhone. And it does the same thing. You can output to a folder, your music folder, your My Documents, wherever you want. Tell it where you want to put all the songs of your iPod into your computer. So, it, you won't lose anything, and... I believe it is free. It's free and it's at coders, codershole.com, right there. And the Apple version is free to try for 30 days. And the it's only 18 bucks if you want to buy it. But if you do have a PC and you are a Windows user, shame on you, um, you'll have a free iDump. Uh, so you can Google iDump and you can get that for free and save you all your money and all your songs. And that is what I wanted to share with you because everybody asks me that question. They say, hey, how do I get my songs from my iPod to my computer? So there you go. There you have it. That's how you do it.